Four, the WBA, the IBF, and Ring Magazine Bantamweight World titles. Let's bring up the challenger. Please welcome Jason Mayhem Maloney and the champion Naoya Inoue, the monster. I don't even know where to begin. I'm just very excited that this is going down, the monster and mayhem on Halloween. I, I don't think he could have planned it any better. Uh, but I want to start with you, the champion. Uh, he has been off nearly for one year since his fight against Donair. He suffered a, a broken orbital bone. Has the time off allowed him to heal properly? And has he had a great training camp to be ready for Saturday night? Yeah, Yes, uh, this past year, my, uh, my injury has healed very well. Great. You've had world title fight experience. Uh, you lost a controversial split decision to Rodriguez. How did that fight change you as a fighter mentally so that when this now happens and you're back in the bubble? Yeah, I really think that everything happens for a reason and that heartbreaking loss two years ago showed me how much I want this and that I'm never going to let a loss happen to me again. I've worked extremely hard to get myself back into this position. And on Saturday night, nothing will stop me from winning this fight and achieving the dream and becoming the number one bantamweight in the world. So I'm extremely excited and couldn't be more ready. Does the bubble allow you to eliminate distractions? Because you know, you're on your phone, you're on social media, you see the news. You're definitely not the favorite to win this fight. We were just talking about it with the women earlier. Are you able to set that aside when you enter the bubble and truly focus on the task at hand? Yeah, I mean, bubble or not, I'm extremely driven and focused. Uh, I know the job that I'm here to do. And whether people think I can win this fight or not, it does not bother me one bit. I believe and I know I can win this fight to the champion. Uh, every time the champion sets, uh, sets foot in the ring, the stakes become higher and higher, obviously. Uh, how do you feel he's dealing with, or how do you feel you're dealing with the pressure of all of these expectations as they continue to grow? え、um, I see him as a, a very high level all around fighter. It's very good. Boss, is there anything that you need to do to open him up and find weakness for us at home as we watch this fight? What do you got to do? Fight my fight. There's weaknesses there, and he's never faced somebody as relentless as me. He's never faced a fighter as physically strong or mentally strong as me. And I'm going to take him to places he's never been before. Let's see how he handles it. I love it. Uh, your, your experience so far here with Top Rank in the bubble, this is a first time experience for you and your camp. How has it been so far? And do you feel that that will uh, jeopardize any elements of your camp or the fight on Saturday night? え、ま、今回トップランクのバブルという中で、え、戦うんですけれども、ま、このバブルに入って、え、バブルの印象と、え、試合に対してどういう影響があると思いますか。ま、ここまでこの、ま、環境、状況すごく、うん、大変な中で
and uh, we'll perform uh, on Saturday night, and you'll see how I did. How have you felt with all of the promotion up to this point? Because there's a lot of hype surrounding this fight. It's mayhem, it's the monster, it's Halloween. How does that make you feel to come into Las Vegas with this incredible marketing team and the social team that has done this fantastic job promoting this fight? How does that, how does that make you feel as the monster rolling into Las Vegas on Halloween? え、マーケティングとしてあなたがモンスターという形で印象をみんなに作ってるんですけれども、ま、ラスベガスにこういうふうに入ってきて、え、非常に大きなプロモーションでモンスターという形になってますけれども、え、それに関してどう感じますかえ